Hi guys, welcome to The Slice. Hey guys, here's my quick interview with Dan Evans, who's on the come up after his suspension. After this interview, he actually won the tournament, which is a Van Open, it's a cha ATP Challenger event. He had to qualify for the tournament, and then he ended up beating uh, guys like Vashik Pospisil to win the tournament, which is crazy. How far do you think he can go in tennis, and what do you think his all-time like you know rank could get to if he really applies himself and stays consistent? All right, Slice fans, we are here with Dan Evans. Um, coming back from a suspension off and playing really well right now. I just made it into the second round now, I guess, of yeah, the Van round. Open here. Um, so we started following you back in 2017 when you were having a bit of a showing out at the Australian Open. Uh, where do you feel your game is at now compared to then when you were at your all-time high ranking of 41? Yeah, it's uh, coming back. Hopefully, um, you know, a few more months and I'll be back, back to where I was playing, but just, you know, taking it day by day, trying to get back to where I was, yeah. Exactly. And you know, there's obviously been a lot of criticism in the mainstream media, um, calling you like a wasted talent, etc, cetera, etc. Cetera. Do you let that fuel you to keep coming back, or is that you kind of just shut it all out and just play your No, I just sort game? of leave all that stuff alone. Obviously, you've made a mistake, and now we've got to start back up again and try and get back there. Beauty. Uh, last year, when you came into the Australian Open, you obviously made it to the fourth round, and you it was kind of cool that you were wearing, I thought, like an unbranded t-shirt. I don't think you had a clothing sponsor then, is that right? Yeah, yeah. So are you are you with anyone right now? No, I'm not with anyone right now. Okay. So just just wearing whatever I like at the minute. That's sweet. It's Dan Evans' own brand. <laughs> um, uh, that's pretty cool. I think I saw some pictures of you wearing LSA. Is that how you say it in England or LS? Uh, LS, yeah. Uh, I bought some of their stuff not too long ago. But uh, anyways, that's pretty fresh. What do you what would you say that at the end of, by the end of 2018 would be your goal for as far as like your results and rankings? Well, I just like to be in the Australian Open qualifying. So yeah, it's um, that'd be a good start for next year to be in the Australian Open qualifying. Right on. Thanks for doing the interview, Dan. No problem. And uh, yeah, we'll see you next time. We'll see you on the court tomorrow. Cheers.